Hello everyone, this is Maxime from FlowThemes and I'm here to introduce you to the new feature that we have coming with the latest installment of Flow Flex Builder, and this is animations. Animations are supported by most Flow Themes except the legacy generations, since this generation doesn't have any support for flex blocks in general. To show you how you can animate the elements in your layout, I will be using an already prepared flex block. To do that, I just go to edit page and open the builder for the flex block. Click on the desired element and then click on the lightning bolt that pops up from the right side of the interface. This will open up the list of all the animation options that we have in stock for you. As of now, you can see that there are several options if you want to fade an element, if you want to zoom it, if you want to make it appear and zoom, or if you want to, it to slide in different directions. So the plan for my blocks that I've prepared is to animate the photo and video content creation line of text and the image on the left, so it would slide from left to right. So I'm picking a slide right from the animation menu and I see a whole lot of settings which pops up as I press the button. Now the most important section here is trigger, which defines the event that starts the animation. It can either be appear, which means that the animation will start as soon as it appears in the viewport. It can be scroll. This will make the effect play out uh, as you are scrolling through the page. Click is rather self-explanatory. You will need to click on the element in order for the effect to play. Last but not least is hover, which uh, starts as soon as you go over an element with the pointer. Right below the trigger section, there's acceleration, which is depicted with curves, the uh, lower points of which are the start of animation and the higher points of which is its finish. You can play it as it is, you can play it rather smoothly, uh, you can play it with small pauses, or you can make it quick at start and slower at the end. Under acceleration, you will find several sliders, the first of which is duration, which directly affects the speed of animation, then delay, which affects when the animation starts or triggers. This might come in handy when you animate several elements and you want them to go one by one, for instance. Uh, the other uh, value over here is travel. Now it's effect specific since uh, slide right travels from left to right. So this defines the distance the element will travel or slide from left to right. Uh, another animation trigger that we have here is scroll. And as you know, when you scroll through the page, the new elements would come from the bottom of the page and then will disappear into the top of it in your viewport. Uh, that's why this start line is below the finish one. So consecutively, finish is the line by which the animation will have stopped playing. So the element is completely loaded by that point. Moving on to the text element, and you can see now here that it is included into a group. Speaking of groups, uh, in terms of animation, they may come as a very useful tool if you want to time sync several animations together. I'm double clicking on an element in order to set it separately. And I use zoom in on the click trigger. So I would click on the element in order for it to play. As you can see, the um, effect specific slider became zoom, which stands for the element's zoom scale. Just for sake of change, I will be choosing a different acceleration. And I will see if, the, if it works correctly. And by the way, if needs be, you can always throw the menu interface over to the left side if that's more comfortable for you. While we're still in Builder, I'd suggest we take a look at the mobile layout. By default, all your effects are copied for the mobile layout, except Hover, since it's unavailable for mobile. If you want other transitions on mobile, simply disable the, the desktop sync. Proceed applying animations in the very same manner. Don't forget to save your progress.
let us see what we have, shall we? I'm sliding down to the block. And as you can see, the image on the left is sliding to right. The text heading that we made is animated on click and is zoomed in. Right. Uh, so that is pretty much it. Have fun with our animation feature. Stay tuned and wait for more.